chef's kiss. All right, so I was probably, I don't know, 14 when this happened. It was at a um, camp at, like, the Bronx Zoo. Um, I don't know. I think it was, like, a week-long program, and I think I was one of two guys that were in the program. Okay. Uh, and the rest were, were girls, and there was, like, 20 of us. So I was there, um, and I was pretty good friends with, i say, most of the people. They split us up into two groups, so I was pretty good friends with most of the people, like, in my group. Okay. Um, and, like, one day, this one girl just comes up to me, and I, I thought we were pretty good friends, right? Mm-hmm. And she just winds up and just gives me a nice smack in the bottom. Oh, damn. I thought you were going to get full five-fingered in the face. That's crazy. Okay. No. No, no. And I, I, didn't, I wasn't, like, expecting that. And my 14-year-old self was a little confused on what to do. <laughs> yeah. Um, so I kind of just, like, continued as normal. Like, just, like, had a normal conversation that that didn't happen. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. And then I can't remember if it was the same day or like a few days later, but it happened again. What the fuck? Okay. She just did the same thing again, right? Oh shit! Here we go again. And yeah, it kind of just ends there. Um, <laughs> I didn't actually realize that she was trying to hit on me until like a year later. I was in the shower. I was like, wait a minute, <laughs> that's what that means. Halfway through shampoo in your hair, you just freeze up. Like God. Damn it. I should have known. But listen. That, I mean, there's two options. One, uh, no meme. Memes aside, that's a girl boss move to like, I like this kid. I'm going to go smack his fucking ass. Like, I'm going to take control of this goddamn situation. (laughs) That girl's a baller. Or she was just bullying the shit out of you. But it turns out she wasn't. So I would have thought like she was just trying to make you look like an idiot. But you had the conversation where she was, like, actually into you. So I think that girl's dope. If you can find her, you know, it's been a while, but hit her up. Say, like, what are you, what are you up to? Do you know what she's up to nowadays? I didn't have any social media at the time. Well, so I Just Google her name and nothing. see what comes up. Because I'm just genuinely interested in what that kind of – at that age, see what kind of person <laughs> that becomes. I want to see what she blossomed into because that's – she probably owns a Fortune 500 company right now. I, I remember her first name, and that's it. Oh. And I asked my sister, who was also at the camp, and I was like, do you remember? And she's like, no, I have no idea. That sucks. Well, hey, you got a story out <laughs> of it. You learned something. You know, you now know a little bit better on how to see green lights. So there you go. If a girl smacks yeah. your ass, you're probably yeah. – you're either in a lot of trouble or you're doing okay. Those are the two options. <laughs> All right. Thank you. No problem. Bless your heart, my son.